Soon, 15,000 Pfizer doses will be coming to UAB on a weekly basis. We're really excited to have additional doses to be able to deliver to the community. Um, as soon as we get those doses in, we're scheduling appointments. Because of this, UAB can open a fifth vaccination site. Now that we have increased vaccine allocation, we are maximizing the capacity that we've built at these sites. This one will be in center point at the Cathedral of the Cross AOH Church. Staffing these sites has been a tremendous challenge, and I got to tell you, our team has been just, they've stepped up to it uh, like like pros. UAB says it's recruited staff from all over the university and its health system. Health care providers have even come out of retirement to offer a helping hand. The community has been a good partner to us also. Uh, you've stepped up. People have volunteered. We have far more volunteers than we need every day who, who are asking what they can do to help. Along with manning the vaccine sites, UAB's next step is to get its staff out in neighborhoods where people don't have internet and register them. My vision and hope is that we'll be able to send people into the community with laptops, with iPads, with things like that so that they can help people get registered. Now, how's that going to look exactly? I don't know the details yet. The hospital's mission is to not leave anyone behind who wants the vaccine. In Birmingham, Magdala Lusant, WVTM 13.